Up first, you see the text. It's another meat locker for the boys. Real quick, though, shout out, shout out to uh, Hedy Dalgadillo, Tufac, Ryan Salisbury, and uh, Absolute Zero. Thankfully, we remember the name. It's Bilal Muhammad taking on Diego Lima, Douglas's little brother, who is coming in on a three-fight win streak, but none of those guys were to the current level of Bilal Muhammad, who keeps winning fights and shouldn't find intense trouble with Diego in this one. What do you like about Remember the Name, and how do you think he gets it in this meat lock? Yeah, you know, uh, what isn't there to not like about Remember the Name? He has been mauling his last three fights, looking so good on the feet, on the ground, just dominating. And I think he's going to get it done uh, pretty dominant fashion. I really agree with Tapology over there. 10% are going with Ligma. It's actually why I'm wearing the glasses. I kind of got Ligma right now, somewhere in the shades. But... Mohammed's going to get it done, you know, get rid of the Ligma virus. Mohammed uh, had Ligma Good's number last fight. I think he's going to have Diego Ligma Good, uh, you know, number this fight too. He's really going to maul him. I mean, 90% are going with an absolute domination, and I think I'm going to have to tend to agree with the community on this one. Yeah, Muhammad has looked amazing. I mean, his only setback was to Jeff Neal. I mean, if you look, if you're looking at his last eight fights and Jeff Neal's fight in the meat event on this slot. So, I mean, he was knocked out by Vicente Luque early in his career, but he's been on an absolute tear. Uh, has nice wins over Randy Brown, Tim Means, Curtis Milliner, Takashi Sato, and Ligma Good, as you mentioned. So, a lot of impressive wins for Remember the Name and. He just gets it done everywhere, right? It's, he's not going to wow you with, with any aspect of his game, but he's also uh, someone who doesn't possess any weaknesses, it seems like. And I envision him just taking down Diego Ligma or uh, keeping this on the feet. Whatever he wants to do with Diego Ligma, I think he's able to. So are you in agree? Uh, do you agree with the uh, topology 90% and the majority of it being decision? Or is there any way to uh, remember the name can sneak a finish in this one? Yeah, I actually think he's going to get a finish. That's the one thing I do not agree with uh, Tapology. I think I'm going with that little uh, you know, sliver of a section where they're going with that KO. I think he's going to get done TKO on the ground uh, second round. Very interesting. Yeah, I would check the stoppage number, see if it's anything interesting. But nonetheless, it's an absolute meat lock. Uh, remember, the name's going to get this one done. We're going to throw down uh, just a decent 86-82 to net 22-26 at uh, not great, but minus 390, you remember the name odds. Say it's a uh, slow sizzle nonetheless. Any last thoughts on this uh, meat lock? No, it's like what you said, a slow sizzle nonetheless. This is an absolute amazing fight, amazing fight card. I uh, hope you meet, boys. Tune in for the rest of the videos. Smash that subscribe, like, throw the comments. Who you guys think is going to win? Is, you know, Diego Ligma going to get it done? And you guys don't think this is an absolute meat lock or... Remember the name is an absolute meat lock and you're agreeing with the boys. Uh, but yeah, take it to the grill and get the bill.